Hello and welcome back to XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and this is the Long War Lone Wolf Run where we're trying to beat the game on the highest difficulty with only one soldier permission. This is going to be a, a pretty compressed review of what is happening in month number 18. We got a few nice resistance ring missions including a recruit the Templar mission with a nice little health bonus. So we're going to do that, reduce avatar progress and a few other goodies. Um, as the only downside in this month is we're probably going to be shut down by the hunter. I'm going to keep you posted of what is happening. And as predicted, we are being shut down by the hunter. So it's time for another defense mission. Like promised beforehand, I'm going to actually shortcut that a little bit and only show you the highlight reel to make it less repetitive. Well, that definitely uh, counts as a highlight here. Look at that, guys. Three <laughs> elite specters in one pack. That's 75 hit points right there. Very deadly pack. But we're going to uh, easily kill it with a couple of explosives. Anyway, still a fun pack. All right, we're getting closer to the actual Chosen. As you can see, we just destroyed the cannon and it's time to mop up the rest of the map. All right, let's jump back into the mix. Time for the Chosen to die. Heavily injured. Let's fight him some more. All right, time for the Chosen to hopefully die. It's run and gun. Let's see what a good old rapid fire can do. Oh, I was expecting way more than that. He's hoping for two criticals. <sighs> Not what I was expecting. Not at all. The Vector Rifle, I think, cannot deal enough damage. Nope, not happening yet. Stay tuned. Alright, third try. Fortunately, he's teleporting. I think he teleported to here. Yep, he's sending apparently right there. All right, let's kill him. Nice. Good, that's it. Chosen done, mission done. A little bit closer than expected at the end, but overall fine. All right, end of month number 18. We made it, guys. Overall, there were a couple of missions which we basically all skipped. We, however, started to research a little bit more. The highlights at research were that uh, we now got a breakthrough for assault rifles, giving us additional damage. We defended our Avenger, um, got a lot of uh, covert ops actions done, specifically the rewards with plus health and mobility go a long way. And we got ourselves another Templar. Uh, which has surprisingly good abilities, not good enough to justify switching the Templar, 
uh, almost, um, but yeah, not almost not good enough. So I'll stick with Hogbite because we invested a lot of time uh, there. All of this here is really just same old, same old. And yeah, we're going into month number 19 now. Here we go. And of course we got shot down once again this time. Not from the hunter, but from the assassin. So it's time for another Royal Rumble uh, whilst we are defending our Avenger. I'll just uh, keep it to the highlights as always. Uh, should be fairly simple as a mission. We've done it quite a few times by now. Alright, and we're back after leveling the majority of the playing field. We spotted out the Chosen, which might be the shortest... Um, the shortest appearance that she ever had here. Let's take a look. Well, we already shredded her armor. Well, you know, I'm not so sure if we're going to fail. Specifically, since we can remove even more cover. She's immune to explosions, but she's certainly not immune to bullets. Very much not the case. There we go. I know that she had bewildering uh, shots, so if we can just hit her often enough she's going to suffer. She packed up quite a few hit points though. So even with all of our hits she still stands surprisingly long. Yep, not a one turn kill. Gotta keep on trying. Alright, so after a short escapade with uh, summoning su uh, two beastly units, we spotted her out once again. Still in the open. I think this time we can uh, finish it. Oh, come on. She's not that difficult to hit. There we go. Very fitting end for her. So that's pretty much it. That's the entire mission. From here on, it is very easy to do the rest. And it is the end of another month. Let's do a little bit of a debriefing what happened this month. It was a pretty eventful, although not like overly eventful month. Um, first and foremost, we continued having some breakthroughs in our research, uh, both for the assault rifles, but also for beam weapons in general. So a lot of extra damage for the weapons is coming through. Um, given that we're now about one and a half years into the game, normally this is, would be the very point where you end the game. So the game is kind of throwing everything in the kitchen sink at us to, to give us an advantage, just to get more uh, damage on our soldiers. We completed yet again really a lot of good covert ops uh, missions. Hogbite is getting stronger and stronger. We're usually netting three to four missions per month, which is good, sometimes even more, sometimes up to five missions. Um, we 
got some Alarium cores, so more armor and bigger weapons there as well. And yeah, we defended the Avenger against the Assassin. So Assassin will take a few months before she returns. The Hunter probably also a few months. So maybe we between two and three months um, uh, timing before they will reappear. The only thing that's happening is a retaliation strike from time to time. Um, the avatar progress overall looks incredibly good, so we're really fine when it comes to this. Oh yeah, and we upgraded the influence with the skirmishers to maximum level. Uh, we could now basically go and infiltrate the stronghold. We're not doing it because, yeah, there's... We, we wouldn't stand a chance with only one soldier to do the stronghold. So we're really in this uh, difficult spot where we cannot do anything against the Chosen. I'm currently preparing the first Golden Path mission, which would be uh, the Black Side Vial. But yeah, since there is no need to immediately do it, might as well just wait with it. For the time being, the only thing that really counts is powering up Hogbite as much as possible. Yep, and with that we're in month number 20, um, August, September of uh, 2036. So, yep, we're playing for the long run. All right, let's grind on. And we're done with yet another month. It was a really, really quiet one. Not much happened. Uh, we got a skirmisher. Uh, it's probably the highlight of it. Our covert ops missions gave us a colonel skirmisher and a few breakthroughs, uh, including the under the table one for additional for additional funds. Yeah, I think we don't need that one. Yeah, I think we don't need that one. So other than that, we're pretty much okay. Uh, looking at the situation, mid of month, uh, mid of September, almost October, uh, two thousand thirty-six. We're really solid. Avatar projects is always uh, pretty much in the middle. Uh, we got a very healthy roster. Nothing uh, particular is happening. So let's just keep on the grind and see that we can level up uh, Hogbite as much as possible. All right, a little highlight right away. There was um, a covered ops mission and we were able to get another facility lead. Starts out very well this month. And we're through the month of October. Really nothing much happened other than our Psy operatives have now completed their training. So there's not much more that they can learn. Uh, we essentially start training new Psy operatives now because it doesn't cost anything. Um, yeah, we had a couple of uh, nice research um, technology research breakthroughs but nothing that would completely change the game. Unfortunately, soon we will need to defend the adventure again. Yeah, all of this here stays pretty much the same. And as you can see, we are on top of uh, the Avatar project. It's run, uh, it's, it's working out reasonably well. The only problem that I'm running into is uh, there is a huge discrepancy between real life time. I probably played for three hours straight and the actual content that um, I am creating with these um, summaries, only a 15 minutes uh, video. So I think I'm going to block it into kind of 15 minutes slots just really um, quick updates, so to speak. And I'll simply upload like two videos um, at a time. 
Uh, this year really is more or less the, the training regiment. Anyways, if you are interested in it, uh, feel free to uh, to watch it. Uh, if you are more looking for kind of the outcome and how how it's going to look once we're done, I think two or three more of these sessions and we should be in a good position to continue the golden path missions. So Black Side Vile and Co. Anyways. We're on it and I'm dedicated to get this run to a positive end. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, leave a comment down below and hit the like button. Thanks. Bye bye.